And Horton. Horton checks past one, checks past two. Going into the box. Willoughby, Luke Conlon, left footed in swinger. And a decent head from Samson there. But comfortably taken by Drench at the end of. Could have had an opportunity to shoot. Phyllis Girk will have a look to shoot. Burke then, who stayed wide. Shaw, can he get it across this time? Checks onto his left foot. Phyllis Girk, he's got Tyler Walton for company. Cross comes in. As far out as Luke Conlon. Coast is certainly looking to line things up. And Horton looking to get another worldie to add to his five goals that he's already got this season. And none of them have been rubbish. Conlon now, Whitmore gets Burke involved on this right side. Whitmore gets it back to Conlon, chips it forward, looking for Samson who gets ahead on it, and that's onside. Now it's offside, apparently. Seemed to be very, very little wrong with that. And uh, Tom Elliott in his camper van is absolutely berating the assistant referee, and in fairness, Tom was a lot closer than I was, but taken off him. Allen gets it forward. And a chance now, so. Perkins to Phyllis Gerg. Horton has now come to this right side. Sends it down the line to Burke. Cross comes in, looking for Willoughby. Who did well there, he just needed a nod. First time we've seen Horton on this right side, set Burke free. Clayton clears it, looking for Tyler Walton. Now look, Conlon, Conlon still has it, inside to Whitmore. Now Shaw has got outside him, but he's got Horton further out. Horton, lovely cross in, looking for Willoughby, who has somehow not scored. And it goes our way for a corner. It was a lovely ball in from Nick Horton. Kurt Willoughby had acres of space. And a good save by Stephen Drench, but one of the fastly defenders is down. So we'll be having more than the added two minutes. We've had a minute and a half of the two so far. We're back, ready to go again. Horton, right-footed. Samson. Screams of some sort of foul from the Farsley players. To throw in to Farsley on that far side. And I think this will possibly be some of the last action of the first half. I'll make it about nine seconds left. Nil-nil. Chris Atkinson having plenty to say to the referee. Carl Johnston having a word with the referee as well. But Jordan Richards will take this throw in, and I think that will be the end of the first half when he blows it. Yep, indeed, it is. Uh, that's the half-time whistle. Nil-nil here at Mill Farm. While I get a little drink of water, Joel's going to play you some adverts, I think. Yep, crack on then. Mr Shackley shouts, keeper, keeper. Thumbs up to his assistant, and it will be Ben Atkinson to his brother Chris, who gets the ball long, two to go at. Left-footed, in-swinging corner, headed away, but only as far as Jordan Richards, who shoots. Well, I hope he doesn't mind me saying, but he, he, he shot like a defender then. Back a bit. And he has given the free kick for the push by... Johnston. Willoughby now. Horton. Horton still going. Some good old fashioned robust tackling going in from both sides. Shaw gets it across. Samson gets ahead on it and off the. And, a... and he's adjusted to be offside. Well taken off his boot there by Danny Ellis. And that's got to be offside, surely. Allows play to continue because Chris Neal had the ball. Conlon, Horton outside on this left wing. Chops inside. And 
somebody's coming on the end of that and yes we have a goal Nathan Shaw with his first for the club and uh, Chris Neal getting some lots of applause there from Alex Whitmore for turning defence into attack very quickly Down the steps. Meanwhile, uh, there's going to be a free kick. Here we go. Finally, free kick comes in, right footed from Jordan Richardson. That's going to be seen out. No, it's put back across the face of goal. Clayton trying to get on it, head on it. Spencer tries to get his head on it. Ball comes across and straight into the hands of Chris Neal from Tom Allen, who I think probably thought he'd scored there. Shaw, little triangles by the coasters. Samson comes back to collect, now free Shaw. Shaw going again, Shaw skips outside one man. Can he get the ball back? No, checks with Conlon. Conlon now has the ball, now Phyllis Girk, right footed, shoots and over the bar. Got his first goal of the season on Wednesday night, but that was never going to trouble Stephen Drench. Attitude about this side, about getting better and better every week and when things are tough making things happen for them Tollett is offside Tollett is not offside because it's gone through to Samson Samson has it and Samson has put it blue Samson has ballooned it uh, granted it's a corner but there's no question about it he should have done better there he couldn't give it to Tollett because Tollett would have been offside Samson had it he had to carry on left here at Mill Farm and now Mondal his first touch inside to Tollett, Tollett still driving, Tollett is, Tollett's in here, Tollett slides it in, oh and a great save by Stephen Drench there, Tollett who scored on Wednesday night did really really well there, Asley half, everybody in the coast is half at the moment bar Bar two, Richards now has it with space on this right side. Lots of players gathering for a diagonal into the box. Lumping it forward, away by Jack Sanders. Finds Samson. Outside to Burke now from Phyllis Girk. Shaw, the goal scorer. Is he going to cut inside? Yes, he is. Gets it into the box for Samson. That's a free kick. Is he giving a free kick there? Now we have Conlon, Shaw and Tollett over this, having a bit of a discussion. And Tollett and Shaw are going to leave this, are they, for the left footer? Or is Tollett... Tollett looks like he's going to have a go for this. Tollett. And he snuck that into the bottom corner. 2-0 to the coasters, round the wall and snuck it just inside Stephen Drench's left post. Neil, long, finds Sampson's head. Tollett, who's just scored the second goal in wonderful fashion. And, and Sampson could have had a hat-trick this afternoon. He almost got that in underneath the body of Stephen Drench. Take it. Richards, in swinger, former Coasters player, headed away by Sampson, only as far as another blue shirt in the box. Spencer gets it across. Sanders, what a, what a strike that was from Jake Charles, acrobatic airborne strike 
done everything that's need, needed a right foot. So Johnston is stepping back from it. It'll be Richards, I would think, will take it. Richards does indeed take it. Long and a good save there by Chris Neal. Pushes it out and that'll be a throw-in. We've got about 30 seconds left. Whether the referee adds anything on to the end of the 30 seconds remains to be seen. Tollett, who got the second goal. Put out for a throw-in. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is it. The coasters are a 100% record from seven games this season. Three wins in the FA Cup, four wins in the league. They sit second behind Gloucester City. And a hard-fought, well-earned three points for the coasters. Final score here, AFC Files 2, Farsley Celtic 0. I'll be back after some messages from our sponsors.